there's so much more to the Cert TESOL than just grammar. It's about having rapport in class. It's about creating really nice materials. And it's about learning, um, learning about yourself and learning about other, other people. It just gives you such a valuable skill that you can then go and use anywhere in the world. It's very much about uh, talking to students, interacting with students, uh, bouncing off each other on the course. It's really a very social thing as well. It's incredibly rewarding for us uh, in the teacher training centre to see our CERT TESOL trainees graduate from the CERT TESOL course, take their first teaching jobs with us, two years later consider taking the diploma in TESOL course with us and then you see them as academic managers in the year-round schools or as centre managers in some of our summer school programmes. Something that's really surprised me about the course is just how close you can get with the group of people you're training with. From the first day we've, we had set up a WhatsApp group and we use it to ask each other for advice or opinions about our teaching and I really didn't expect that social side of the course. And from very early on, they are in the real classroom with real students, uh, together with the tutors as well, that support them throughout the teaching journey. I chose the Cert TESOL course um, in here because it provided a real life scenario teaching in front of people, which with other courses um, wasn't a possibility, so it really gives you that hands-on experience. It has given me confidence, it has helped me with techniques and ways to explore the different uh, features of phonology, so I'm much more confident. Teaching on the CERT TESOL will be the first time that a lot of people will have stood up in front of a class and actually taught. But as part of the course, there's support, training and guidance to help you get through those initial teaching experiences. So there's people from different backgrounds, some people have English as their first language, some of them speak more than one language as well, so it's really interesting to see how people compare and work with their knowledge of different languages. One minute you might be studying grammar or, or language, uh, you could be in class observing um, other teachers and writing up your commentary on that. You'll also be teaching. The thing that I've enjoyed most about the course so far is the, the chance to really get to know one learner very well. So as part of the course you analyse their needs, um, whether they need to work on their listening or their speaking for example, and you are able to develop a programme to help them improve in those areas. One of the key skills learnt on the CERT TESOL is that of reflection. And it's reflection on what happens in the classroom and acting on that which helps you become a better teacher. Once trainees graduate from the CERT TESOL course, they will receive a certificate, but they'll also receive a very detailed and personalised report on their performance throughout the individual components of the CERT TESOL, including the six hours observed teaching practice. The depth that we go into with the phonology and with the how to plan a lesson and the techniques used um, was really surprising, but very good because um, it just provides me with more resources that I can then use later on after the course.